Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Samsung Galaxy S10 here and I'm gonna show you three ways that you can do a screenshot. First way is to ask Bixby to take a screenshot. So here's the Bixby button right here. The only thing is with the Bixby button is you have to sign up for it. But the thing is you don't actually have to sign up for a new Samsung account or anything. The only thing I did was simply just log in with my Gmail account. Anyway, Bixby is kind of like the Siri on the iPhones. So what I simply do is press and hold the Bixby button and then ask it to take a screenshot, okay? Ready? Take a screenshot and you can see it flash. Now the second way is to do a palm swipe, which I don't recommend, it's kind of difficult to do sometimes, and I don't know anybody that uses the palm swipe to take a screenshot. Anyways, you just slide your hand from the edge of the phone to the other side, or vice versa, it doesn't matter which way you do it. Let me just do it this way here. And you can see it flash right there. Now over 90% of you guys would do it this way, and this is the way I prefer too, is simply hold two buttons simultaneously, the volume down button and the power button, ready? One, two, three, just hold them both down, until you see that flash. I'll do it again for you. Ready? One, two, three. Wait for the flash. And there's a screenshot right there. Now, all the screenshots do get saved to your gallery. Also, let me show you some additional functions here. Let me go ahead and take a screenshot here. Let's say you want to take a screenshot. You can see this entire article here. So, for instance, let me go ahead and take a screenshot here. And then down here, this icon right here, I can push down. It's going to slide down. I want to show more. I want to show more. I want to show more. And then from that screenshot right there, you can actually see how long it is. I'll go into my gallery here, and that last screenshot I just took is right here, and we can see how long that is. Also, if I take another screenshot here, we have some other options down here too. Of course, I can go ahead and I can crop this as well. I can go ahead and add it to, or put it anywhere I want it if I just want to leave it like that. Go ahead and click on Save. And then if I go to my gallery here, we'll go to my last screenshot I just took right there and you can see it right there and let me take another screenshot here and then you also get the pen here as well so if I tap on the pen here you can go ahead and do whatever you want you can write something or you can basically like circle something and then you can go ahead and just save it from there and it'll go into the gallery as well well there you guys go that is the three ways to take a screenshot on your s10 and uh, I hope that helped you out guys take a screenshot Freaking Bixby.